It's Friday afternoon at a big sky. Bob McGuire with you here in the Q2 Weather Center. And it is a simply gorgeous day out there today. Check it out. Current temperature's not too bad either. 46 degrees with mostly sunny skies. The only difference is it is a little on the breezy side. Winds out of the southwest at 25 miles per hour. Around the rest of the state, temps are mostly into the 30s out in the west and along the high line. But in central Montana, like around Lewistown and, and places like Jordan and uh, Livingston, things are a little bit warmer. Livingston and Jordan both in the 50s right now. It's 51 over at Sheridan. And as you can see, we do have some gusty winds across the eastern slopes to divide. Livingston seeing a 28 mile per hour wind gust, 30 mile per hour winds over in the Billings area, and also over a cut bank, it's 29 mile per hour winds in that area. But as you'll see on the Doppler radar and satellite imagery, the scope is dry from one side of the state to the other. Our high resolution forecast model says that stuff's going to stay that way for the rest of today. And then maybe by Saturday morning, we start to see a little minor weather impulse move in from the north, could push its way through the Billings area by that afternoon. And then another batch of moisture starts moving in Saturday night on into Sunday morning. By Sunday afternoon, it looks like another batch of cold air starts moving through and we could see some scattered snow showers develop just in time for what's going to be a very snowy week ahead. Check this out. By Sunday morning, we're still looking at just some light snow flurries in Kalispell and Missoula, but then as the day goes on by 10 o'clock that night, we get some more light snow there. And then for the rest of the day, Monday right on through Thanksgiving Day, we could see maybe as much as 6 to 10 inches of snow in the Billings area. Same thing over in the Livingston area, so it could be a snowy week ahead. In the meantime, the temperature is going to be 48 degrees next hour, back down to the 30s in the morning, back up to 50 degrees about this time tomorrow afternoon we'll top out at 52 on saturday 54 on sunday and then the temperatures will fall and then the snow will fall with it for the rest of thanksgiving week we'll have a complete forecast coming your way at 5:30 tonight on the q2 news or you can check us out online at ktvq.com